This method can help answer key questions in the cell signaling field, such as the importance of different protein domains in receptor enzyme interaction and enzymatic activation. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows concomitant testing of receptor enzyme interactions and the functional consequences of this interaction on the enzyme activity. For each plate, use 10 milliliters of DMEM supplemented with 10% FBS and 1% penicillin and streptomycin. The day before transfection, seed human embryonic kidney 293 T cells into 12 10 centimeter plates using a hemocytometer to count the cells. Incubate at 37 degrees Celsius in 5% CO2. Once the cells are 80 to 90% confluent, use a lipid based transfection agent to transfect five of the plates. Perform the transfection following the manufacturer's instructions for adherent cells in 10 centimeter plates. Then, transfect an identical second set of five plates, along with one additional plate serving as a non transfected control for the measurement of expressed protein amount before the immunoprecipitation. Incubate the transfected plates in a tissue culture incubator at 37 degrees Celsius in 5% CO2 for 48 hours. Use a fluorescent microscope to examine the cells for GFP expression and ensure that transfection has successfully occurred. Mix 50 microliters of 100 millimolar...